Hey guys, Alan McComas here. Uh, just wanted to throw out another new video here. Have it for a couple weeks. Um, this one's about, uh, oh, by the way, I'm not in my car, my car studio, like the rest of the videos. In fact, Janie and I are in uh, Fort Myers Beach, taking a long um, weekend sabbatical uh, with my sister that came in from Las Vegas. Anyway, just to show you here. There's the beach right there. Pretty cool, very relaxing. Anyway, I just wanted to share a quick, uh, another house deal story with you. The, uh, when I talked on my original video about investing, getting cash flow through real estate without buying houses, I talked about every deal. We uh, make sure there's five winners. Uh, the first winner is a seller who gets cash for the property, gets uh, out of their problem property. Um, so they're happy just to be out from under it. Um, the second one is the rehabber, normally us, uh, goes in, fixes up the property. Uh, third is the private lenders. The, uh, it gets a guaranteed, usually eight, ten percent, uh, sometimes twelve percent uh, interest each month. It's uh, their money secured by a, a mortgage on the property. Um, then the last two winners uh, was the uh, end, the tenant buyer or tenants. Uh, we try to do tenant buyers, rent to own uh, tenants. Um, they have to be a winner. They have to like the property. Um, and then the fifth is the neighborhood. And what I want to tell you real quick is uh, we bought five houses in the last uh, six, eight weeks. But uh, one I'm going to tell you, I'll tell you about some other ones later. Each time, every, every deal has a story. But uh, this one, uh, Thorndale on the south side of uh, Columbus, uh, we bought it for 20000 uh, From an older lady, just, it was a rental. She just wanted, wanted the cash, get out. She didn't want to mess with it. Actually, her, one of her sons uh, lived in it. They were uh, probably not getting along. Anyway, we bought it uh, um, after going in. We sent them a letter. Um, we bought them with the people in it. We sent them a letter, gave them, giving them a 60-day notice uh, that we wanted possession of the property back so we could get it fixed up and we would help them find a new place. Um, within a day, they were gone. Actually, after we went in there, kind of found out they were growing. Uh, it was a pot-growing house. Um, so anyway, and obviously the neighbors didn't. I uh, think they were very good neighbors also. And we bought that place for 20, put 10 in it, got it fixed up really, really good. Uh, rents for 900. Found two a very nice young couple. They had great jobs. They're sous chefs in very high end restaurants in Columbus, and they are very happy. Uh, they want to eventually work to rent to own. Um, and uh, anyway, they are very happy. Renting for $900 a month. It's four bedroom yard. They can actually eventually have kids, and we'll work with them if they want to do a rent to own later. We'll work with them, help them uh, figure out what they need to do to get financing and all that stuff. Um, and that's the fourth winner in the scenario. The fifth winner is the neighborhood. Uh, when our leasing agent was down there uh, taking applications and showing up for lease, uh, many neighbors come over. And even after the tenants moved in, they really, they liked the tenants, they thanked us for fixing it up because that was the uh, ugly house in the neighborhood, especially with the uh, goings on in the neighborhood, people coming and going all the time. So all the other houses are, are nice, nice families. So. Anyway, neighborhood is thanked us many times. So, anyway, that's the story about Thorndale. And uh, until next time, uh, be cool, stay laid back. All right, peace.